How to use ko so ado kotoba. In order to express this, that, and which in Japanese, we have these words that are used that are called ko so ado kotoba. The reason why it's called this is that there are words that start with ko, and all of these words refer to things that are near the speaker. Words that start with so are then words that are referring to things that are near the listener. Words that start with a is then referring to things that are distant from both the speaker and the listener, like that over there. And then finally, do is used for questions, like which. So the most simplest way you'll see these words are used are like kore, sore, are, and dore. Kore means this. Kore wa otousan no lightsaber da. Sore means that, close to the listener. Kore ga mokutei nan daro? Sore wa hikari disku da. Are means that, distant from both the speaker and the listener. And dore means which. And you can also see these sounds attached to the not possessive particle. And this kind of expresses like this something. Like here, this battle. Or sono, that, like that way of speaking. Ano is that something distant from both the speaker and the listener. Here, Waka is pointing to a house way over there. So that house over there. Bisaidomura Dono is used for which something? Here referring to which girl. So there are many girls, which one? Dono onna no ko. And this is actually using the not possessive particle. That's how you can see there's this relationship. This town. Which town? Which person? Which dun dun dun. And there's also a set of words that you can use to refer to this place, that place, and which place. And those words are koko, here. Soko, there, close to the listener. Asoko, over there, distant from both the speaker and the listener. No. Oi, asoko. And doko, where? Where are you? We also have a set of words used when talking about a direction, like this way, kochira. So, dozo kochira. So, dozo kochira. Ah, wakarimashita. That way, Sochida. Nara, Chuton Hegaskuna, East Pur Homenga Ikedo, Sochida Mukau Hashinga Koarechimatene. That way over there, Achida. Achida no go Fujima. Oh, Musme no Charlotte. Which direction, Dochida? Dakedo, Fumetsuna Monova. And there's even a more casual contraction that you'll see used, especially in spoken language. Instead of kochida, you might see kochi over here. This is a more colloquial spoken way of using the language. And the same thing applies with Sochida, Sochi. Achida, Achi. Dochida, Dochi. Mafia no Hanashiwa Uso no Ka? And we even have a set of words that you can use to express like this. 
or like that. So when you want to do an action like this, you need to use call in front of the verb. So to do something in this way. And so the same thing, do something in that way, would be saw. Do something in that way over there would be ah. Do something in what way would be do. So you just use these pieces of language before a verb. And you can do the same thing with nouns as well. Konna, like this, you can use this in front of a noun, like konna tokoro, a place like this. Nanto? Sonna, like that. Anna, like that over there. Anna, like what? So kind of like what kind of? Donna hito? What kind of person? Donna machi, what kind of town? And so normally when you want to say this person, you would say Kono hito, this person. But when speaking in a rough manner, like you may see used in video games and manga and things like that, you'll often see this next piece of language used. Koitsu, for kind of like this guy. Soitsu, that guy. Aitsu, that person over there. Doitsu, what thing or what person? So these koso adult words are incredibly useful for helping you with your Japanese. As you can see, they're fundamental pieces of language that you're likely to see absolutely everywhere. Just remember that the words that start with ko is close to the speaker, the words that start with so are close to the listener, the words that start with a are distant from both the speaker and the listener, and the words that start with do is a question. So hopefully this video has helped you out seeing how ko so ado words are used in Japanese. If you like this video, make sure to like, leave a comment, and if you really love the channel, then consider coming joining us in the Game Gengo Discord community. It really helps out the channel, and you can also join us in the Discord community community and get help with your Japanese, chat with a whole bunch of people as well as chat with me personally, and just meet a whole bunch of like-minded people who just want to have fun learning Japanese. So thanks so much guys for watching, hope you're enjoying learning Japanese, and as always, I'll see you again in the next video. See you guys.